Understanding, don't be shy, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to explore a common English phrase, don't be shy. This expression is often used in everyday conversations, and understanding its nuances can really help in both social and professional settings. Let's dive in to understand what it means and how you can use it effectively. Don't be shy is an encouragement often given to someone who seems hesitant or nervous. It's like saying, feel free to speak up or take action. This phrase is used in situations where someone might be feeling unsure or embarrassed about expressing themselves, participating in an activity, or asking questions. 2.1 in social gatherings. In social contexts, don't be shy might be used to encourage someone to join a conversation, try something new, or meet new people. It's a friendly nudge to be more outgoing. 2.2 in classrooms or meetings. Teachers or leaders might use this phrase to encourage students or team members to ask questions or share their opinions. It's a way to create a more inclusive and open environment. 2.3 in offering or accepting things. When someone is offering you something, like food or help, they might say, don't be shy, to mean, please, don't hesitate to accept. In different cultures, the interpretation of don't be shy can vary. In some cultures, being reserved is valued, while in others, being outspoken is appreciated. Understanding the cultural context is key to using this phrase appropriately. If you want to express a similar sentiment without using the exact phrase, you could say, feel free to speak up. Your input is welcome, please, join in. Don't be shy is a versatile phrase used to encourage participation and openness. Remember, it's all about context. Whether you're in a meeting, at a party, or offering help, using this phrase can help put others at ease. We hope this video helps you understand and use, don't be shy, more confidently in your conversations. Happy learning!